I'm not sure Sarah will get bored, you know. She's at least to live on a farm with Auntie and Joe and feed baby lambs and everything. Oh, well, from what I heard, it was a real battlefield. She's not going to have many happy memories. Well, I know Andy's got the right to have some time with the kids, obviously. The car's gone. What, you mean that flash car you took in yesterday? Yeah, it's for a client. It could mean loads more work. Well, maybe I haven't stuck it for a test drive. Please tell me that you know where that car is. No, I thought you were taking it. We'd be stupid enough to take a car off the forecourt and then drive it through the village. Surely someone would see. Right, well, we need to start asking about. Come on. I warned you, you just don't listen, do you? Don't know what you're on about. Yeah? Well, you're a lousy liar. As well as a lousy thief, then. I thought I was supposed to be the one that breaks the cars down anyway. I'm saving you the bother. Or trying to hide something more like. Are you wasting your time? I knew you'd nick that mower. Uh, that's the name of the game, isn't it? Do you know what? I, I tried to convince myself even you couldn't be that stupid. I got away with it, didn't I? Ever heard the saying, don't do it on your own doorstep? Hey, Debbie might be family to you, but I don't owe her anything. Well, maybe I've got to teach you a different way, then. Oh, yeah? Hey. What does that mean? It means we're done. Buy my own, thanks. Plenty of other places you can sit, you know. Well, you've got a good thing going here, and you know it. Yeah, and you had to ruin it. What's done is done. I've shifted it now, anyway. There's nothing that can come back on you, so I reckon it's time to move forward. <laughs> that might change your mind. What's that? Your cut. <laughs> what are you on? I told you I don't want anything to do with it. I don't want anything to do with you. If you drop me in it, you'll be digging your own grave. And charities. Just take the money. This partnership, it's too good to waste. Yeah, well, I told you. I don't want any part of this one. And the partnership? The partnership goes on. As long as you don't pull a stunt like that again. Right, I bet they get back to work. You're gonna tell Debbie? Not if this is gonna be the last time, no. You just can't stay out of trouble, can you? All right, peg leg. What's your problem? Same as always. You? Well, I'm not that fond of you either. So why don't we stay out of each other's faces? <laughs> Look, you and I couldn't stand the sight of each other. Now, you're drinking together. I'm a friendly sort of guy. Didn't look like that. Like you were arguing over dividing your loot. You stole that car off Debbie's forecourt. You're gonna need a bit more than seeing two blokes having a drink together to prove that. Oh, because I know you. I know that you did it. Nothing to do with me. Although I can't say I was that sorry to hear it. She deserves it for sacking me. <laughs> so that's what it's about, is it? <laughs> there is nothing you can do. So why don't you go back to mocking out cow sheds where you belong? <laughs> 